As we stand outside BMO Field, we must reflect on some pretty dark times for Toronto FC fans over the years, Craig. Now, if they manage to get through Montreal and progress to the final, what will it mean to this club as a franchise? Oh, it'll mean an awful lot. I mean, we've seen this uh, club evolve from the last 10 years, and most of it has been disappointing to say the least and you have to credit the fans because they've showed up consistently at the box office to support this team through thick and thin and most of it's been thick to be fair <laughs> until this present moment when they've actually got an opportunity to go to the uh, to the uh, MLS Cup final which is obviously what has been a dream and the ownership has also put a lot into this club as well and spent an awful lot to try to give back to the fans who have been loyal and so far so good this year. Now Montreal though is uh, more storied certainly than TFC they've had some big moments in the past as well. If they get through TFC, will this be their biggest moment? Oh, absolutely. Now, we have to say they were in the CONCACAF Champions League against Club America a couple years ago, which was incredible. But I think from a public uh, point of view and opinion, would be this would be much bigger. It's the MLS. People know it much more than the CONCACAF Champions League, although that's a terrific tournament in itself. Uh, but Montreal have done very, very well. Uh, just to get to where they are, they've been the underdog in the first round against DC United, against the Red Bulls, which they've done very well. And they've been very good away from home. So they've put themselves in a pretty good position here against Toronto FC. Well, it's 3-2 entering the second leg. Who would you rather be at this point? TFC, who know that 1-0 or 2-1 or a different scoreline would be enough, or mm -hmm. Montreal, that know a draw would suffice as well. Well, if I was a betting man, and I do sometimes, uh, <laughs> I would say that Toronto FC, those two away goals were massive, and also momentum as well. But then again, I have to go back to what I said a minute ago, is that Toronto FC have been, or Montreal have been excellent away from home. A really good team, and they'll uh, be uh, you know, looking at this game as a great opportunity. And with those two away goals for Toronto FC, probably see themselves as major underdogs, to be fair. Well, it should be fun on yet another biggest game in franchise history for both clubs.